Thank you for calling J. Allen Toyota Service. This is what happens when you set an appointment at J. Allen Toyota Service. We will order the part right then, so it'll be here when your appointment comes. Our greeter staff will greet you quickly and friendly and top off your fluids before your car even leaves the drive. Then your car will go to one of our six two-man express teams or one of our 10 certified technicians so they can get you back on the road safely and quickly. This is service the way it should be at J. Allen Toyota Service. So here we are in Biloxi, Mississippi at the Traditions, the State of the Art Facility, Memorial Hospital Clinic. Today I'm honored because I get to meet Dr. Scott as well as you, the one and only one culinary specialist located here on the Mississippi Gulf Coast. So let's go in and see a little bit about what's going on. Well, come on in. Dr. Scott? Hi. Hi. <laughs> I've heard so much about you, Courtney Anderson. Nice to meet you, Dr. Thank Scott. Thank you for meeting with Coastal Connections with Courtney. And well, I'd love to sit down and just ask a few questions if you don't mind. I would love that. Thank you so much. Okay, well, I'm going to sit right here if that's okay. Great. So, Dr. Scott, a lot of people are not familiar with what exactly is a culinary specialist. Yeah, culinary medicine is one of the biggest areas that is starting to grow here in the United States. Uh, with culinary medicine, we're actually teaching patients and empowering patients to eat healthier, and we also teach them how to cook as well. Okay, and has all of this, it's unveiling, and you're the only one here on the coast. I mean, this is very state-of-the-art. Memorial Hospital has added this to the coast, along with so many other things. And I bet you feel really excited and eager to get in there being the number one and only person on the coast doing this. Yeah, I'm very excited. Cooking and food is my yeah. passion, and to be able to, to, to teach it to my patients is really exciting for me. You are incorporating healthy lifestyles that's going to help Memorial with the quality of life, with the treatments, with yes. the physical activity. So tell me about what, why does this so important to you and to the coast? Yeah, it's a big thing here on the coast. There are wonderful foods in the, that we have to uh, um, give to patients and those things, but we have to look forward to the, the, the negative aspects of eating the wrong types of foods and too many types of foods. Um, some of the medical foods that you eat, um, too many high diets in your food, uh, too much sodium in your food can lead to high blood pressure, can lead to cancers and those things. So it's important to eat a healthier diet and a healthier lifestyle to prevent those. Mm -hmm. A lot of patients don't realize that the, the foods that they eat control some of the things in their body. Uh, all the micronutrients and those things help to improve your health and, and your uh, vitality. Well, the foods and the lifestyles that you, we, you're going to be teaching myself and the coast, how important is the physical activity? Oh, physical activity is very important. Right. Uh, one of the things that the uh, CDC recommends as well as doing, getting that exercise and the walking activity at least three times a week. Uh, 30 minutes at a time that'll get that um, perfect uh, body fitness that you need to. For me, like getting through the day, sometimes I start getting tired, even when I'm damn eating healthy, and I just need a little perk me up, whether mm -hmm. it be just a treat or something. So show me a few healthy things, and maybe you could recommend a book or websites that have helped you that are going to educate us. Well, I can show you some things that are unhealthy right. to start first. Oh, I, I was know. like, you can eat a honey book? <laughs> oh, these are the things you probably need to stay away from. <laughs> Okay, show me. Um, Sometimes uh, when people uh, are, are in a rush and they're trying to grab something quick for lunch or snacks, they'll just run into a convenience store and pick up a few things on the, on the, on the rack. These are very um, common items and snack chips and those things. But if you look at the back of this label, there's a great deal of information on these nutritional labels that patients should um, pay, pay more attention to. 
Uh, the things you want to look forward to is see how many servings per uh, container is in here. Uh, the serving size and how many servings and it does each uh, container can uh, have in it as well. Look at the number of calories. These calories are per serving. That's 150 calories per serving. And I, well, you know they're going to eat the whole bag. The whole if they're bag. anything like me, they're not going to eat 12 chips a serving. The whole bag is 14. So they, they, they give you a, a, right. a comparison so you can see what you, exactly what you're doing. Well, that is very informative. Uh, this is very corned beef hash. This is a, a something that's going to fill you up very quickly. Mm -hmm. uh, it's more of a, um, a, a quick food to have. Uh, if you look at the back of it here, wow. it's a significant amount of uh, saturated fat. 45% in one serving uh, is what you're getting. And look at the sodium, 870 milligrams. So it tastes good. Oh my <laughs> God, I love salt. But, but this is, and then that's what leads to all the cholesterol and down the road, you don't realize it when you're younger, but it will catch up with you, absolutely. It's affecting you. For sure. Uh, and this is very common, just something to pour down on a, on a hot day. Right. 140 calories, uh, that's per serving. One can is a wow. serving size, but look at this. Look at the sugar content. Oh my gosh. There's 38 uh, grams of uh, total sugar in there, and then you look at the included sugars, this is what's added in there. With your new specialty you're bringing to the coast, are there snacks that will fill the spot and give you a little bit of the carb satisfaction rather than eat a bag of Doritos? Yeah, you want to get things that have low fat. Uh, okay. Look for the labels that say low fat on there. Look at uh, the back of the label and see what's in it. But low fat is going to be good for you. Uh, eating more things like your fruits and vegetables, uh, fresh fruits, bananas, oranges, apples. Mm -hmm. Those things seem to be a little more filling. Uh, eating more um, nuts, almonds, uh, okay. walnuts. Those things have healthy omega-3 fatty acids, which helps um, for your heart. Okay, well, I don't want to get too personal, but what did you eat for lunch? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tell me just a little bit about it. Like, you go wake up in the morning, take me through a day with Dr. Scott. I'll start preparing foods on, on, on the night before or the weekend before uh, doing my meal prep. The weekend, so you'll do it a whole week. Yeah, you do. Oh, meal that's prep. a great idea. Uh, some of the things that I included in my uh, lunch for today: I had salmon, I had Brussels sprouts, I had um, red uh, red peppers. All those things kind of work together to uh, improve your health. You have the omega-3 fatty acids that come from the salmon. Those are the, those are the healthy fatty acids, mm -hmm. the healthy oils for you. I put a little of that um, uh, of the um, red peppers in there that gives you the oh. flavonoids that you need. Those things are, are micronutrients that help increase your, um, your good, good health. I would love to just go a day and see what you eat and eat with you. That's, you feel so good when you eat a good meal, you treat your body well, you just mm -hmm. feel better, you perform work, you're more useful in the community, everything is great. And you know, things like this, some people have to go through different experiences to reach out to somebody like you. Very but you're true. gonna be reaching out to younger ages. You're gonna be bringing something to the coast that we've never had before. Yeah, I'm very excited. I'm I know, very excited. I bet you're so proud of yourself. This is awesome. So it's, gonna be, it's gonna be a good time. And you're young, you're vivacious, you're fresh, right out of number one school, Pennsylvania. That's pretty sharp. Yeah, I'm excited. Oh, Dr. Scott, thank you so much. I appreciate it. You know what? Do you mind if I hug you? Oh, thank you. <laughs> it was such a pleasure, and I want to be back. Okay, I'm Okay. You. You, thank you. you so much. Unbreakable. We are a beacon of healing, resolute and consistent, determined. We are problem solvers, driven to overcoming obstacles, unshakable. We are prepared, capable, experienced, unbeatable. We are a network of people providing care throughout your lifetime. We are believers in the healing power of compassion. We are Memorial. Visit the Gulf Coast's newest casino. Come in today and experience the beautiful, smoke-free Beachview Casino. Pick your game. We have your favorite slots and table games and a sports book. Enjoy incredible views while you dine at one of our many restaurants. And grab a drink while you enjoy live entertainment every weekend in the heart of the action. The Gulf Coast's newest, the smoke-free Beachview Casino Resort, Gulfport. Hey, Louie in the house for some home safety tips. I can see that you're quick learners because you moved that cord away from the burners. 
he can damage cords and show off their wires and damage cords and overload his sockets on fires. Water and appliances sure don't mix, but that's an easy problem to fix. Keep electrical things away from tubs and sinks, you see, and when you're in the house, play it safe around electricity. Yeah. Visit the Gulf Coast's newest casino. Come in today and experience the beautiful, smoke-free Beachview Casino. Pick your game. We have your favorite slots and table games and a sports book. Enjoy incredible views while you dine at one of our many restaurants. And grab a drink while you enjoy live entertainment every weekend in the heart of the action. The Gulf Coast's newest, the smoke-free Beachview Casino Resort, Gulfport. Hey y'all, I'm so excited. We're here at the Lynn Meadows Discovery Center. We're gonna get an actual live tour with the Executive Director, Cindy DeFrancis. Let's go check it out. This is gonna be so much fun. Hey, now we're in the Lynn Meadows Discovery Center. This is my dear friend, Cindy DeFrancis, Executive Director of Lynn Meadows. Tell us what's going on. I heard it's renovating and oh, so many great things starting to happen. Uh, Courtney, you're absolutely right. Yeah. We've got so many fun things happening right now, and we are right now in the port. And if you look down, you see brand new That's carpet. That's what I was thinking. And so the carpet um, is one of our pieces of our renovation that was desperately needed. And so yeah. we have brand new carpet throughout the museum. If you look around, you'll see we have a boat, we have a shrimp yes. boat over there. And so everything here, of course, at the museum is hands-on. And so when they And come, educational. Oh, You're absolutely. Learning, absolutely. So cool. It's very engaging, very, you know, intuitive. Children kind of just know what to do when they get to one of these yeah. exciting exhibits. But this one, for instance, you know, they get to go over there and dress up as a shrimper. They get to, you know, fish and net and shrimp, and <laughs> it's always well, um, I love this. I want yeah. to see more. Okay, well, Great. let's go see more. Cindy, that's awesome. So that's the pet vet, and they go in there, learn all about being a doctor and the money. I love it. Yeah. I mean, look, they're having such a great they're time. They're having a blast with all the animals wanting the little doctor. So you doctors have, like, little prescription bottles. <laughs> yes, we try to make everything interactive, yeah, hands-on. I love and, it. And real life, I mean, you know. Right, so. exactly. And they're learning and having fun. Their imagination's starting. And I love this, and it's just everything's so nice. Yeah, I mean, this is our bear camp by you. Okay. This is for our four and under um, children. Four and under, okay. And so this is another area that just got a facelift, and we've got all brand new carpeting in here. It's squishy and, so and it nice. Is. It's state-of-the-art carpet that um, is designed specifically for heavy-duty right. wear and tear. And so since children are on their hands and knees, a lot of them have come in here. Exactly. I mean, this is so easy to clean and for us to be able to maintain. Right, so. and you know what I think is so interesting? A lot of people don't realize that y'all are such a large nonprofit, and it is so nice. The renovation we're making it the number one, you know, on the coast and really the south. And I mean, it's so nice. So these are all donations and grants. So tell me about that. Yes, um, actually, the renovations that we're undergoing right now are all through grants, and so Amazing. we've been receiving grants for the last couple of years, and so. Um, of one of the grants is for renovations because you know this building is uh, over a hundred years old. This wow. is the old. See, I didn't know that. Yes, this is the wow. old Mississippi City Elementary School, oh, and so nice. it was in operation from like 1915 until the 1970s, and it stayed closed down until 1998 when uh, Mississippi City Elementary School became Lynn Meadows Discovery Center. I and love so, it, Cindy. How many years have you been doing this as executive director? I've been here now over 10 years. That's what I yes. thought, and everybody adores yeah. you. Oh. All the people that were working with you were like, I love her 
hug it on. Oh, that's so sweet. It's just it's good energy in here. It's amazing, and yeah. you're getting it all one, all in the whole day. You're learning, yes. you're visiting, yes. my camaraderie. Yes. It's good for the children. It is, absolutely. Well, show me what else going on. Well, before we go to the next section, I'd like to stop and show you something that we're very proud of. What is and it? And so this is our national medal. We were recognized in 2016 at an uh, award ceremony at the White House and was given this wow. by the First Lady, as a matter of fact. She focused on one museum and one library. There were only 10 of okay. us receiving the award, five museums, five libraries, and she focused on one of each. And we were the one that she focused on and gave all the attention to when she was giving her speech about how a children's museum is such an asset to the community and that without a children's museum, the Absolutely. community doesn't thrive. And, so, and then she says, such as Lynn Meadows Discovery Center. Here and in Gulfport, Mississippi. Yes, That's so, huge. It was just, you know, I, I mean, I still get goosebumps I just thinking do. about it. I know, but it was such a, an honor. Mm -hmm. And um, so we're very proud of that. And now we're going to head up the ramp and we're going to. We're going to go this yes, way. Yes, we're going to go this oh. way. I know, and this is like one of my favorites to watch children play. Thank you for calling J. Allen Toyota Service. This is what happens when you set an appointment at J. Allen Toyota Service. We will order the part right then so it'll be here when your appointment comes. Our greeter staff will greet you quickly and friendly and top off your fluids before your car even leaves the drive. Then your car will go to one of our six two-man express teams or one of our 10 certified technicians so they can get you back on the road safely and quickly. This is service the way it should be at J. Allen Toyota Service. What is all this? This is great talk show. We, we're, we're live, Courtney. We are what now. Is, we are now oh doing gosh, the we weather. Are. <laughs> oh, look how fun! And this, or this, what age group would you say you usually play in here? I'd say probably from four on up. Yeah. The, yeah. The, the younger ones aren't quite. I mean, they'll come, sit in the chair, bounce, and run, you know. Or they'll, and you know what's cool is as you get older, you look back on these yes. things. These planted the little seed and the vision, like, yes. you know, like they can say, Lynn Meadows, I remember I was the one playing in, yes. you know, the vet area, or I was the person that wanted to be the weather girl. Yes, cool. absolutely. Love I mean, it. Yes. So, it's I mean. Great. So there's lots of opportunities here for children to experience, you know, possibly a, a career. So, yeah, yes. I mean, this is one of them. I mean, exactly. I agree. I mean, I would come all the time. <laughs> and I know it's fun working here. It is fun working here. And you have all these little angel babies around. We do. We and do. all the art's so pretty. Who does the murals downstairs and like the um, sea? That, that particular mural was done by the Junior Auxiliary of Gulfport. They came and they helped our in-house artist, Carla Shero. She, um, wow. she kind of helped design it and kind of get everything placed and right. drawn out. And they came and helped paint and it. And hands on so, painting. Yeah. yeah. Isn't that great? Junior Auxiliary Gulfport, they're amazing. And Bluffy, of course. Of course. Just a great organization. Yeah. Cindy, this is fun. <laughs> Let me guess what this is. <laughs> this is a grocery. Awesome. Yeah. It's our little grocery store. And fresh and market. Yes. Right here. Yes. We've got fresh produce. We've got fresh flowers. I love <laughs> and we have shoppers. It. <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> And then they get to pick. They do. This and, is great. And you know, a lot of the kids will actually put all the groceries back when they're finished. I mean, look, she's going and putting them back when she's finished. And so and I you're think, just learning those yeah, skills. Yeah, they're learning Absolutely. You know, real life hands on skills that they will always need to know and right. use in the future. So And grabbing ingredients, yeah. probably when the parents are out here telling them what they're cooking, they're yeah. like, go get that. Exactly. I and love then, it. of course, the money aspect because they get to go to the cash register and check out and yes. see how expensive groceries are now. No, really, that's. <laughs> Yes, I, would, I should have been at the cash register. <laughs> but that is great. This is just really, really nice. Yeah. And the bakery. Yes, and we've got the little seafood, seafood market. You can order the fish. Yeah. So, so you can do a one-day pass or you, or you buy can. like a year membership. Yes, yes. That's, what, that's yes. great. Yes, and so right now we, have, we actually have over 1,200 members. So we have a lot of people who come on a regular basis. And then, of course, we have our tourists and, you know, people from out of town. Yeah. So, so we have people from all over the place who come to see Lynn Meadows 
just got my Well, Cindy, you have definitely impressed us, and we're going to keep coming back and checking in and see what you're getting your hands into, because I know you have a lot of events coming up. Yeah, so, and, you know, you'll always see something different when you come. Right, so. and you're learning. Yes. And you're learning skills and, yes. you know. Actually, the next time you come, we will have a brand new exhibit in our science area. So, I'm just going to tell you right now. I'm, I'm yeah, not tell gonna, me right now. I'm not going to give you a whole lot of information, but it's going to be yeah. a brand new state-of-the-art science STEM related exhibit that we are in the process of designing and it will be installed probably the second week in March and so we are looking forward to that. You didn't mention that renovation I didn't, girl. I forgot about That's that. Cool. <laughs> we'll be back. We're yes, so you'll have to come yes. for our grand opening for that but we're working with uh, yeah, absolutely. a huge business be partner here. on that. Yes. Well, Cindy, thank you. All right. Thank it's you. a pleasure working with I you. Know. It's so comfortable <laughs> being with your friends. So I thank know. you so much. Absolutely. For this.